Uh, now, we're talking food, and Lisa's got your Boxing Day meal completely sorted for you. I love leftovers, but the veggies always seem to get overlooked. Well, not with my bubble and squeak jacket potatoes. The humble potato, jacket potato, I'm just going to take them and put across. Oh, I just get my knife so that it sort of skewers right down. If you've got a microwave, stick them in the microwave for about five or six minutes and it will really start them off. But you can do it all in your oven if you want. Um, I just take a little bit of oil, a tiny bit of oil in my hands and just rub the potato. So they're not really greasy, they've just got a little coating. And they go into a tray and into the oven for a good hour. I would say even an hour and a half. My potatoes have had a good hour. They are hot, but I can still pick them up. And I'm just going to cut them in half. I'm going to try to keep them like this. And then I'm just going to scoop out my potato inside into a bowl. And scoop. It is hot. You can wait for it to cool down. I love a jacket potato. Over Christmas, you have so much sort of rich food. It's lovely to have something that's just an old faithful, I think. So we've got our potatoes there. And then I'm going to add to this my leftovers. Any leftovers that you have, you can put in this. So I've got some cabbage and some peas. I've also got some spring onions and a bit of sage to make it Christmassy. Nice bit of butter. And then slice those spring onions nice and fine. Some sage. It's a strong flavour. If you want to, you can leave it out. You can just use dried sage from a jar. I've got a little bit of cheese here. Any cheese you want, mix that together. And then I've got some cabbage and some leftover peas. And all those things that you think, oh, should we just throw them away because there's only a few of those left? Just keep them and put them in your potato. A little bit of salt and pepper, a little bit extra cheese because that will sort of bind it all, keep it stuck together. And now we're going to scoop it back into our potatoes. Be generous, I think. And these are going to go into the oven to warm through for about 10 to 15 minutes. To top off my jackets, I'm going to make a fried egg. It really works, it's really delicious. It's a little bit of oil into a pan. I'm just going to add a little bit of butter as well, just a bit. The oil helps cook the egg and the butter adds just an extra bit of flavour that, that I can't resist. Because I cook on telly, I always want it to be perfect. But, you know, you're at home, it's betwixtmas. You just want your leftovers and a fried egg. So my eggs are ready. My jacket's out. Scoop that out. Potatoes. Like so. Put of cheese on that. And we are ready to go. Comfort food at its best. I love a fried egg. Well done, Lisa. You can find the recipe for that and lots more delicious food on our website.